let me give you a little piece of advice. Before you implement WooCommerce HPOS, which stands for High Performance Order Storage, do this one thing just to make sure you don't miss any services or systems that use your site with the legacy API. The legacy API, the legacy API is not compatible with HPOS. So what I recommend you do is install this plugin, REST API Log. What that does is it records all REST API access to your site. And then through that, we can search through the results and make sure that nothing is using any endpoints that aren't compatible with HPOS. Let's just have a quick look at the settings. So it's just all about the um, number of days that we save our entries for, the routes that we're gonna log. You can log them all, switch some off if you want to. There's some elastic press settings that we're not really interested in as far as we're concerned. But essentially what that does is it creates a log of all REST API. So if you look in the tools, we have a REST API log. So we can see things like auto saves, that's all good. It's on version two, so we're not worried about that. But if we were to do, so in my Postman setup, I can send a test request to that. So even though that failed, we can see that it listed the orders and then this code runs the orders. What we're looking for are legacy endpoints. So we can export this, search through it and make sure no legacy endpoints. If you check the blog post, I'll include a list of the legacy endpoints. So if you find any of those are being active, accessed, you know you have a compatibility issue you need to fix before you implement HPOS.